Hello everyone, in this video I will be solving Cambridge IGCC Information and Communication Technology Paper 3 for February March 2023. I am going to solve the web page task and the file management. The spreadsheet is already done and uploaded. You can find the link in the description. So we are going to do from task 3 file management and image manipulation. Create a new folder called TCC. So we have our working files here. We have to create a new folder called TCC. So right click new folder TCC. Locate the following files and store them in your TCC folder. These four files we have to store in the TCC folder. So M23 back logo TCC and M23 text move it to TCC folder. Open and edit the file M23 logo by reflecting it horizontally. So I am using Photoshop here to edit the image. Open the image from TCC M23 logo. So we need to reflect the image horizontally and rotate it 180 degrees so that the text is readable. So go to image, image rotation, first flip the canvas horizontal, next we need to rotate it 180 degree, so go to image rotation again 180 degree, so the text is readable now. Reduce the image dimensions to 900 pixels wide by 180 pixels high. To resize the image, go to image, image size and change the width to 900. Since the aspect ratio is already set, uh, the height is changed to 180. Give OK. So the image size is changed now. Save this image in your TCC folder in .png format using the file name TCC logo followed by your candidate number. So let's export this image. File export. Export as a PNG image and the name is TCC logo. So choose the file type as PNG and export and the name is TCC logo followed by your candidate number. Display the contents of your TCC folder showing folder name, all uh, file names, extensions, image dimension and file size. So this is your folder. We need to show all the details, all the details about the file. So right click, view, content. So it will show all the image types, the dimensions, size, everything. So let's take a screenshot. Make sure the file folder name is visible. So that is your step 9 evidence in your evidence document. I have pasted the screenshot. Next web page. You are going to create a style sheet and part of a web page for the Tavara Cricket Club. Make sure your style sheet contains no HTML. Make sure uh, HTML and style sheet are as sufficient as possible. So create a new style sheet in your TCC folder called m23tcc.css. So I am using Microsoft Expression Web. So we need a new style sheet. So go to File, New, CSS. It should be saved as M23 TCC in your folder, in your TCC folder, M23 TCC, save. 
add the CSS to meet the specification. So first style is the background color. Background color is applicable for the body style which uh, represents the background for the whole web page. So first we do body style. So go to format new style. body we need to set the background color so go to background background color and the color components are given here the blue is 0a green 04 and red component 6d so the order of the color components is rgb red green blue so we need to enter the name in that order and the color components the hexadecimal color component always starts with a hash so let's type a hash there and then we can give the color components first red 6d then green and then blue so hash 6d 04 0a so the background color is set you okay Next, we have to set the style for H1, H2, H3 and P. So, let's create a new style again. H1, H2, H3, P. So, all these styles are having the same specification. So, the phone style is Domino. If it's not available, Domino regular, otherwise the default serif phone. So we need to type these three values separated by comma in the given order. So the phone family, I give Domino, comma, Domino regular, comma, serif. And the phone color is yellow. So the phone color select yellow here. You okay. So that style is done. Next is the table style. The alignment is given center within the browser window. So again new style. We have to set for the table. Now for the alignment to be the table to be aligned centered we need to set the margin of the table. So click on box you can see the margin here. So the margin both the left and right margin should be automatically set to move to the center so that the table will be center aligned. So don't remove the selection only we have to set the left and right margin. So the right margin you will set it as auto and the left margin auto so that the table will be aligned to the center horizontally. Next the borders are collapsed and not visible. So click on table you can find the border collapse property here. Set it to collapse and next we have to if the borders are not visible so go to border border style you can set as none and the border width zero so that no border will be visible give ok place your name center number and candidate number as a common at the start of the style sheet so the start of the style sheet you need to write the comment so comment is written by adding a slash star then write your candidate details name center number and candidate number now you need to close the comment give a space then star slash so this is how you write comment in a style sheet 
save your style sheet place a copy of your style sheet in your evidence document so save your style sheet now let's take a screenshot of this this is step 10 evidence Open in your TCC folder the web page called m23 tcc.htm. So open the file which is given in your TCC m23 TCC. This file. The web page has a structure like this. Each cell contains a letter which must not appear on your final web page. Replace the letter A with the image TCC logo that you saved in step 9. So here you can see the letter A. Remove that and let's insert the image. So go to insert picture. So this is the image which we saved TCC logo insert. Or as alternate text you can add logo alternate text is the text which will appear in case your image does not load on the web page so give ok cell B with the contents of the file m23 text.txt so open m23 text you can copy this text from this file and we should place it in place of B. So remove B from here. You can paste it there. C with the image m23 bat.jpg. So remove C from here and insert picture bat. So you can write click it back give ok D with the text web page created by followed by your name center number and candidate number so in D web page created by your name center number candidate number Apply style H2 to all text in cells B and D. So these are cells B and D. Select these two cells. We have to apply H2 style. So click here and select H2. Make sure aspect ratio of both images are maintained. We have not changed anything. Edit this web page so that the table fits 85% of the browser window. So right click table properties, specify width and give 85%. Okay. Attach the style sheet m23 tcc.css. So you can click on attach style sheet here browse and m23 cc select the required style sheet open and ok save the web page display the web page in your browser you can save this so display the web page in the browser So this is the web page. Take a screenshot evidence and place this in your evidence document. Make sure all the page can be seen, all the text can be read and the address bar is fully visible.
so let's take the screenshot of this web page make sure the address bar is fully visible and the complete table is visible So this is step 13, evidence. Web page. Next display the HTML source, take a copy of the HTML source and place this in your evidence document. So same step we need to show the HTML source you can go to the code and copy the code from here select all code and copy paste it here. Next, print your evidence document. So, the web page task is done and now you have to print the evidence document. This is the evidence document. So, the task is done. The spreadsheet task have been already uploaded. You can find the link in the description. Thank you for now.